A family, four children in the car, found alive two days after they vanished in the snow. Temperatures at night were 20 below zero. So how did all of them, including a three-year-old, make it out? ABC's Clayton Sandell has their story. Tonight, a frigid 48-hour ordeal is over. After two adults and four children, the youngest, just three years old, today found alive. We're glad that they've all been found, you know, and, and uh, everybody's prayers have been answered. 34-year-old James Glanton, his girlfriend, 25-year-old Christina McEntee, along with their two kids and their niece and nephew, went to play in the snow Sunday and vanished. That kicked off a desperate search in the remote snowy mountains northeast of Reno. 200 people looking on the ground and in the air as nighttime temperatures dropped to 20 below zero. We just got to find them. We've known them forever, you know, and those little tiny kids, they can't be out there. None of them can be out there in the cold like this. But today, after homing in on a cell phone signal, a member of the search party spotted the family's Jeep through binoculars. They are in amazing condition considering what they've been through. A member of the search team tells ABC that while driving, their Jeep went up an embankment and flipped over. They survived by burning the Jeep's spare tire to stay warm. They had food and water and said that at night they could hear rescuers blowing whistles and helicopters in the distance. They knew a lot of people were looking for them. Despite the extreme cold, doctors say no one suffered any frostbite. All the kids were warm. Their dad did a excellent job. After a quick checkup at the hospital, all six are expected to spend the night at home. Clayton Sandell, ABC News.